Dion's been just about everything in her career. The only thing she's never been is at a loss for words. Even now, when people ask about all that she's done, she says, I don't know why people are so curious about my life. They need to get their own. Mm -hmm. I remember when I had the honor of doing my Dionne Warwick impression opposite the actual Dionne Warwick on SNL. Okay. <laughs> thank you. Let's, thank you guys. Thank you. Let's just say the stakes weren't exactly low, so I was incredibly nervous. On top of being face to face with Ms. Dion, the sketch ends with the two of us singing a duet of what the world needs now on live television. So I wanted to rehearse it over and over and over again. And after the third time, someone asked Ms. Dion if she wanted to run it again. And she kindly said, I know the song. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> of course she did. It's her song. It's like I forgot for a second I was pretending to be her and she was actually her. So come on, Ego. And as decent as my impression may be, it doesn't come close to all that Miss Dion is. She is so uniquely herself. Lena Horne once told her, always, always be you. You cannot be anyone but you. And Miss Dion, you have certainly taken those words to heart. It's the very reason you will always, and I mean always, be relevant.